I think people often think other people are looking at them more than they really are. So just just go to that class, focus on what you're doing, and I think you know it, it's not so bad. I'm Tom Vanderbilt. I'm a writer and author of the new book, Beginners. There's an increasing move toward specialization. You're, you're supposed to be, you know, do the things that you're good at. And those things have become increasingly narrow in, in the last few years. And we focus so much on, on work. So, so sometimes this can happen even among children where they really don't want to take, don't, don't want to try something that they might not uh, be good at, which I think is a is a great loss because it sends the message that we should only do things that we're good at and leaves a lot of potential things we might really enjoy in our lives off the table. I think once you start learning one thing, it's, it's an additive, uh, an addictive process. And suddenly, you know, if you start, I picked up drawing, suddenly I wanted to paint. And then there down the hall, there was a sculpture class. I was thinking, well, sculpture would be kind of interesting to take. And, and it just, it's, sort of like a, a, a superpower. I, I feel like that just can give you confidence in, in all kinds of other areas of life. I mean, there, there's a famous study that found that scientists that had won the Nobel Prize were more likely to have engaged in amateur pursuits like performing arts or even being an amateur uh, magician, I think one of them did. And the, the thought is that, that maybe they picked up something that sparked their in that in that pursuit that sparked something in their scientific discipline it gave them a new perspective maybe it just made them feel better and more more positive it gave them a certain energy but there there seems to be a link there i'll just have one message i tried to get across quite a bit with, with something like singing but it also applies to other things that a lot of us you know often have this idea that they don't have the quote unquote natural talent to do something it doesn't take that much time to get better and if I had a dollar for the amount of time someone says they're they're tone deaf when actually they're not tone deaf, that's just an excuse. Uh, you know, you can you can get better. Would be like the takeaway. That's not all about natural talent. I urge people always, you know, don't give up. Like you know, give it a, give a little time. But I, I sort of pull the cord pretty quickly on on welding. You you can't look back. You, there's always ten other things that you might want to take a take a crack at.